A Boy and His Mirror Marchant Davis, illustrated by Katura A. Bobo Once upon a time, there was a boy named Chris, who had this hair no one could miss. It was long and curly. Some kids called it girly. But Chris liked it. Hey, it's a real good fit. Some kids laughed. Some liked to stare. Dang, Chris thought, it's only hair. His mom said, kids sure do like to tease, but if you like it, try to feel at ease. Chris walked by the mirror, checked out the view, took a deeper look. Would it offer a clue? And then, right there, a woman appeared. It was kind of wild and a little weird. In a faraway land, child, you'd look like a king. They'd love you just as you are, tell you don't change a thing. Who are you? No, who are you? That's the question. So what will you do? So Chris decided he'd act like a king. That just might work. It'll be his new thing. He strolled right on by, showing bling, acting cool. But the kids didn't get it. Some were still kind of cruel. Hoping to see things a little bit clearer, Chris went back to his golden mirror. Oh, mirror, oh, mirror, you got any advice on how to make kids treat me nice? And then, again, the woman appeared. It was kind of wild and a little weird. Oh, child, I know kids are acting mean, but there are better ways to make yourself seen. you got to be the best kind of king. It's not about swagger. It's not about bling. You're a kid who's kind and extremely smart. Try showing them what's in your mind and your great big heart. At recess, Chris announced he had something to say, told those kids, I think there's a better way. How about we stop judging, quit calling names, be a little more chill, stop playing games. And one more thing I want to say to you. My hair is amazing and yours is too. Then Chris was real happy to hear a bunch of kids giving a cheer. Even better, one kid told Chris, I like what you said. It's no fun when kids diss. The reason I never came up to you was I thought maybe you were too cool. Now I get we're all good in our own way. So thanks for that. Now how about we play? I want to play too. Don't forget about me. And when Chris looked up, one kid turned to three. Chris beamed out a smile to all his new friends, and they all played together till recess end. Back at his mirror at the end of the day, Chris was real happy and had something to say. Oh, mirror, oh, mirror, with your golden bling. Tried what you said, and I did a new thing. Walked like a king, and I was nice. So thanks for all the good advice. His mom said, Chris, I'm glad you figured it out. You're the perfect you, without a doubt. The end. I hope you enjoyed listening and reading along with me today. Please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe so we could come back together and read more books. Until next time, bye friends!